Hey guys, it's Jeff with Simply Derivative. Here's the daily recap video. It's uh, Wednesday, uh, August 1st, actually. And uh, we're taking a look here at the E-mini S&P 500, the ES uh, futures contract. Today, we had the Fed meeting. Uh, they came out, and obviously, they didn't raise rates. Um, they left that, those unchanged and looking for the September and December meetings for possible rate uh, hikes. It's almost guaranteed for September if you look at the CME's um, interest rate or, or Fed watch tool that they have on their website. It shows that uh, the futures market has it pinned down at about a 95 to 98% chance on, on September and then um, I think over a 60 or 70% chance in, in December for a rate hike. Anyways, they, they, uh, they left rates unchanged. The market basically was range bound a lot of the day. Um, traded lower and then bounced going into the close and then sold off. Uh, there were a couple of opportunities. We actually had three opportunities today uh, within the first five minute um, chart. We had an opportunity to get long, made a few points on the way up, and then we had a supply uh, or, or um, uh, sell zone up here um, where we thought some selling pressure may come in. Um, it, this is on the day session only chart. It had not been uh, hit yet. Price had not come up there uh, based on this chart, and so this was the first time it did that. If you look at the 24-hour uh, chart, you can see that prices did go up into that level and actually reversed out of it, and so that's what uh, confirmed the trade for us, was having that confluence of seeing the market overnight come down from that level, not touching that level quite yet on this day session only, and then finally getting up there and able to do that. So um, that was a short opportunity. And then after the um, Fed announcement, you had an opportunity to get long um, down close to this 2805 area uh, was another opportunity uh, for a day trade here in the ES. And so um, overall decent day. Uh, we made some money in the day, but um, we're going to see how, how the market trades going into the rest of the week. Um, you know, we're... we're we're bouncing pretty close to that 2800 level, trying to see if we can hold that and then move higher back towards the highs. If not, we're probably going to head towards this 2740 area, um, at least shorter term, and um, possibly look for a bounce there. So uh, that's it for today, guys. Uh, check the link below. Click the link below. Next Tuesday, we're doing a free live webinar, uh, Trading Without Fear. Um, uh, seats are filling up real quick and so you want to be sure to grab your seat today click the link below reserve your spot and we'll see you next week uh, there in the webinar otherwise we'll see you uh, here later this week uh, in the room so have a good one guys take care